Hello. Hello, Priscilla. Hi, I'm sorry. My student is late, so everything is late. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? I'm so good. How about you? I'm doing well. Thank you so much. How have you been? So I'm I've been with the same. <laughs> I'm so good. Yeah. Well, sorry. How have you been lately? Então, recentemente, que você está trabalhando ah, muito. Ah, ok, ok. <laughs> uh, so, uh, I've been work a lot of. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. How about you? Uh, How have you been? Yeah. I've been doing well. I've been working, going to school, studying, you know, boring. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Wearing stuff, yeah. And um, have you done anything um, interesting related to English? So listen to any um, good music in English or watch any good shows in English? So, yes. Uh, so recently, uh, I listening to the band, Bring and A2. Do you know Bring, mm -hmm. Bring and A2? I like yeah, so much yeah. band, rock music. Mm -hmm. So, with Brina A2, let me see another one, Link Park, uh, Link Park, mm -hmm. Suns for Eight, I think it is it, Suns for Eight. Oh, I don't know that one. Is rock music like Link Park? <laughs> okay. I think um, is rock music your favorite type of music? Yes, rock music, and sometimes I like to listen to rip hop music. And pop mm -hmm. pop music like, uh, let's see, one band, Ava Lavigne, I think it's Ava Lavigne, pop music. Ava like Lavigne, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Um, is this the lesson you want today? Yes. Okay. Oh, how have you been? Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so, fine, go, fine or great. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, hello, I'm Jen. It's so nice to see you again. Today we will practice greeting a friend after a long time. Can you repeat? So, okay. Uh, hello, I am Jen. It's so nice to see you again. Today we will practice greeting a friend after a long time. Good. Any questions about this? No, at the moment not. Okay. So greeting after a long time. Um, Leandro, oh my gosh, hi. Um, it's been a long time. How long has it been? Five years? I haven't seen you in forever. I'm glad we ran into each other. So your turn. Okay. Um, Priscilla, oh my gosh, hi. It's been so long. Uh, it has been a long time. How mm -hmm. long has it been? Five years. I haven't seen you in forever. Uh, I'm glad you ran into. How do you say ran? That's correct. It's pronounced ran. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad we ran into each other. Yes, excellent. So for this one here, you can say it's been too long, or it's been a long time. Okay. So one oh. of the two. Okay. And then I haven't seen you in ages, or I haven't seen you in years, or forever. Okay? Okay. So, uh, in this case, Oops, forever sorry. is... Uh, okay. In this case, forever is different. So, you, para sempre in, in Portuguese? Uh, yeah, I don't know what forever is. So, I haven't seen you in forever. Okay. Um, não te vejo... Não... Translated doesn't make sense in Portuguese. So in Portuguese, is uh, forever is for the same. I think it's yeah, case, exactly. I think it's this case depends uh, on context, a context of the phrase. É, eu não te vejo in forever. <laughs> so, <laughs> <No>. a long <laughs> time. <laughs> yeah, in a long time. But I don't know how you would say that in Portuguese when you haven't. Tem anos que eu não te vejo, right? Okay. In Portuguese. Yeah, I like that. I think it's forever. <laughs> yeah, because 
forever in, in English, I haven't seen you in forever. It's like, um, it's been a long, long time. Oh, like, okay. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Hi, Mark. I haven't seen you in a while. Hey, Jen. Yeah, it has been too long. It is great to see you. It's nice to see you, too. I'm glad we ran into each other. Do you know the significance of that phrase? Let me, let me see. It's nice to see you, too. I am great to you. I I don't have no idea what is great when when each other Glad. and other people, but great we ran into. I don't know what it's. Um, imagine we are at a supermarket, at a grocery store. When you see someone at the grocery store, é bom de ver o é bom um, que a gente encontrou. Nós encontraram. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it's like it's like that. Oh, I'm glad we ran into each other. It wasn't planned. Okay, I understand. Mm -hmm. So talking about a recent past. Um. Okay, so I will ask you the question and you choose a response. Okay. So hi, how have you been? So uh, I'm okay. Okay. Um, hey. How have you been doing? So, uh, I'm fine. So, uh, mm -hmm. so this, this question, how have you been doing? Uh, it's like, how are you or not? Um, so, how are you and how have you been are almost the same. Almost. Almost. Okay. But how have you been? It's covering a couple days. So, how are you? Como, como você está agora, right? But how have you been? Esses últimos dias, como que você está? Oh, okay. I understand. Yeah, yeah. So, that's why when somebody says, how are you? Good, good, me too. How have you been? So, like the past... Oh, it's about past. Yeah, yesterday. in the... Yeah, like the past week, how have you been? Oh, okay. And these... All the same, all the same meaning. Okay, understand. So you can no. choose, yeah. So what have you been up to? So, uh, fine. Okay. Oh, sorry. This one here, what have you been up to, is a little bit more specific. Que você está fazendo recentemente? So is when I use up to, uh, mm -hmm. is re more recent? Like um, yesterday or last week? This one, porque muda aqui, porque fala what instead of how. Então, ah, okay. não é como, mas é que você está fazendo. Mm, okay. Então, it's next to an action. Mm. Oh, I've been studying, I've been working, I've been reading a lot. Oh, okay, understand. What have you okay. been so yeah, sorry, sorry. The, these two are the same. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah, because they're both how. Okay. Hi, how have you been? So great. Okay. Um, I've been watching a lot of movies lately. What have you been up to? So uh uh, I've been watching a lot of movies lately. What have you been up to? I've been reading a lot. How about you? So I've been listening to music. Mm -hmm. oh.